The great thing about this project as well, the great thing about Look Up Liverpool is from the beginning when we just had the idea of Look Up Liverpool, it was so simple. But we took it to the Heritage Lottery Fund to see if they would support it. They thought it was a great project, so much so that uh, a few months into the project they asked if they would, if Yellow House and Look Up Liverpool could be used on their promotional DVD for the Heritage Lottery Fund to show how to run and to coordinate and to plan a really good project. Something that we're really proud of. Yeah, Look Up Liverpool, it's a project that we're doing at Yellow House and it's basically sort of a, a rediscovering Liverpool for ourselves as residents of Liverpool and it's also to present Liverpool to people who, who may not uh, you know, be vis just be visiting as, as tourists or you know, here for, for several months and it, it's a way for, for us to discover uh, the architecture and uh, the buildings that are, you know, sort of like every day we, we walk past them because we live here we walk past them and most people do walk past them but we're, uh, we're trying to make them aware of, of what brilliant buildings are here because, uh, you know, I, th I think a hotel pool it's like kind of, uh, it's a similar thing where uh, other people from outside Liverpool would probably know more about the buildings than the people that, that are here. And you know, some people uh, travel uh, all across the world to, uh, to see Liverpool because of the history and the music, the Beatles, and uh, the docks, you know. And uh, this project that we're doing now, I, th I think it's, it's actually uh, rediscovering uh, treasures in the buildings and architecture and um, uh, making it sort of uh, relevant for people who live here as well as people who are going to visit here for the first time and it, it's showing the people uh, what treasures are there and you know what brilliant architecture is still, still here and you know it doesn't cost any money to see them it, it, it just takes a little time to discover them and I, I think uh, what Liverpool is doing it's kind of uh, redefining Liverpool and making these places that you know are not maybe well known or well publicised, and it, it's putting it uh, back on the map, really. It's putting you know, the buildings back on the map. Look up Liverpool is a um, project. The project we're doing about um, going into Liverpool and looking at its lost beauty, should I say, like over the top of shops mainly but then there's all the back buildings that nobody sees that has got substantial beauty about them um, basically my perspective of Look at Liverpool is to, is to go through Liverpool and knowing that, this, that there is this beauty within the one level of shopping if you just look up just that tiny bit and you can just see beauty in our buildings, it's fantastic. Look up Liverpool is going great because um, we're all working on our own bit but we're all coming together as a group. So we're making a difference to Liverpool. The project is about um, getting people getting people to recognise their city and their surroundings and getting people aware that we are here and we are people and we do have a voice and we like people to listen to us. We, me and you and Gosia took some photographs around the city centre to represent buildings and what the buildings meant to me and the colours of the buildings. It'd be very interesting for people from other countries to see our history and to see how we've progressed through the years. In Lock Up Liverpool was a project by Yellow House and um, what it was is because we we see buildings but we don't actually look up at them and we were looking and seeing different parts and Gosher and George thought it would be a good idea to take 
photos of buildings that you'd never see before or you weren't quite sure on like the architecture or something. And it was yeah, quite it's been quite a good project and enjoyable and seeing different things on buildings and laying in about buildings and that. I think though when when we look around our own city we don't realise how much beautiful ar architecture there is. And we look and we go, well that's nice and just walk we look at it and just walk right past it really. And then when you find out what the building, the history behind the building is, you go, whoa, I didn't know that used to be like a docker's house or a postman's office or something like that. And it was, it's been really interesting finding out certain things about buildings, different aspects, and not just looking at like St George's Hall or the, or the live buildings, but looking at different buildings that are like sort of behind the scenes of Liverpool. And it's been really interesting, like I remember I was taking a picture on the top of um, the town hall and this man stopped me and said, hey mate, what are you doing? And I said, um, well we're doing a project called Look Up Liverpool. And um, he said he used to be like one of the saving people in the town hall, he used to save the food and that. And he told me a bit of the sto a story, I can't, which I can't remember, but it was good having like his insight. And when you were taking photos, people were stopping and giving you funny looks, like saying, what the, what are you doing there? Or, you knew what they were thinking, but they didn't say it. And like, it, it felt like I was like a visitor in my own city as well, because I was just doing something different that I wouldn't have done before. Plus, seeing different parts of buildings and the architecture as well, it, it's really fascinating and enjoyable as well. It's great work with all the young people in Yellow House, and Yellow House has been at the centre of the heartbeat, centre of the heart of Liverpool for more than 20 years now doing great work like Look Up Liverpool.